Hey Sensi fans, it's Sarah from Sensi with Sarah Lynn on Facebook. This is my first official YouTube video. I apologize for the poor camera quality. Um, I'm in the midst of a move, so anything off screen is just a box disaster. I'm really excited my future videos will be coming to you in August from my new home office, which I'm really excited about. I finally have a spot for all my Sensi stuff. Um, I'm going to start my video series with a Bring Back My Bar June 2017 haul. I'm going to highlight what I decided I had to have out of the 20 cents. Sensi doesn't discontinue our cents, we actually retire them. So, I wish we could keep them all, because some of them are total gems, but we can't. So, the ones that we move out and put into retirement to make room for our new scent. Sensi gives us a chance to bring those bars back twice a year, once in January, once in June. Um, Sensi lovers can vote for their favorite scents and then they bring them back for 30 days, twice a year. Uh, so I bought 11 out of 20 and some of them I had to have multiples of because either I've experienced them before, I read the notes and I knew I'd love them, or some of the scents, which you'll see in part two of my haul series, um, they received great reviews and people were really excited to have them back. So some I loved, some I knew I'd love, and others I just wanted to give a try. So without further ado, we're going to start with Happy Birthday, which is an all-time fave. Everyone always, always, always asks me about Happy Birthday. Do we have it? When are we getting it back? So in the month of June, my customers, a lot of them, ordered Happy Birthday. So, as soon as it came, I couldn't resist. I had to throw it in the warmer and see what all the fuss was about because I knew I'd love it, but I had never tried it before. As you can see, it's a beautiful pink wax and I'm already missing some cubes because I either burnt them myself or I used some to make samples. If you're not already on my sample mailing list, please send me your information and you will receive a sample of Happy Birthday on your birthday. Super sweet. So, Happy Birthday is exactly what it sounds like. Confetti cake in a bar. It's delicious. I smell rainbow chip Betty Crocker cake mix, fluffy sugary vanilla frosting. And at the bottom, I, for some reason when I smell the bottom of this bar, I smell chocolate. I don't know why, maybe my nose is confused or I'm smelling too much stuff, but I smell chocolate. Um, it evokes so many memories for me of birthdays from when I was a kid to birthdays with my children now. It's just, it's so much fun. How could you not love this? Any time of year, in any room, um, makes me hungry, makes me want to celebrate. I love it. It's great. Let's read the Scentsy Notes. Scentsy Notes for happy birthday. A candy delicious confection of sparkling sugar, fluffy whipped cream, and warm vanilla extract. Maybe it's the vanilla extract that I smell and not chocolate, obviously, um, based on the notes, but it's delicious and hopefully, I'm guessing, will win Bring Back My Bar in 2018 because it's such, such, such a popular scent. So, number two on my list was Bogum. I wasn't too sure about this one. I ordered lots of Happy Birthday for my own personal collection. I wasn't too sure about Bogum, so I only ordered two. I already broke that bar. I always break it and have to smell the line. Or, quick note for people who don't know how to store their Scentsy bars. So, the fragrance oil will settle in your bar. You don't want to do this and store your bars like that because then all the fragrance will settle in the bottom three. You want it to be evenly distributed. So I always do it like this. So this, sorry, getting back to it, is like throwback to my childhood days with my brother. He was a huge trading card fan and I'd always go to the store with him and my mom and tell my mom I want trading cards. And she's like, what do you want trading cards for? I just wanted the cards so I could trade my brother for the gum. It's delicious. Makes me miss my baby brother. He's now a grown man who lives on the west coast, but that's what bubblegum reminds me of. It's the good old days with my brother. 
So the Scentsy Notes say the true scent of baseball card bubble gum, sugar, cotton candy with a hint of mint. I don't detect mint at all when I smell this, but it's delicious. If you like sweet, sugary, confectionery type scents, this is definitely a hit. And I don't find it overpowering, but I also haven't warmed it yet. I'm guessing it won't have too much of a throw to it, but um, it'll be good for a smaller room. I'm probably going to warm this a lot in my 13-year-old bedroom. In my 13-year-old's bedroom, she loves candy scents, so I ordered two of these with her in mind as well. The next one on my list was banana nut bread. Um, hands down, knew I loved it, so I ordered eight. Um, usually, I like the bakery scents in the fall, but I thought maybe this one would be good year round and I probably want to warm it right away. So I need it enough to last me maybe all summer into the fall, who knows. At least until January 2018 when there's another bring back my bar so I could vote for it again. It's this beautiful creamy colored wax. Cold, it smells to me more like banana cream pie than nut bread for some reason, but mm. Banana bread is Ella's homemade staple food, and thankfully her Gigi, my grandma, great-grandma, um, makes hands down the best banana nut bread, so we had to have eight of these. The scent notes say, speaking of Ella, <laughs> right from the oven with ripe bananas, nuts, and spices. I maybe smell the nuts, but I don't smell the spices in here. Perhaps that's why it smells more like pie to me than the banana nut bread. So, I don't know, but it's a winner. Hands down, one of my favorites. Next one on my list was frosted ginger cookie. Um, not overly a fan of ginger home fragrances, but I do love baked goodies. So I thought, hmm, why not? I'll order three. I um, might not love it in the summer, but definitely, definitely going to want to smell this in the fall. The ginger on this, like, wow, 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 wow. Look out, Martha Stewart. Sensi makes a killer ginger cookie. This ginger, I think, will make this bar definitely a top performer. I'm going to guess that this is going to have quite a throw to it. Probably going to warm this my living room, dining room, kitchen area in the fall, and probably well into the Christmas season. Like this is, this is a beautiful, beautiful baked scent to it. It's amazing. Uh, let's see what the Scentsy notes say. Frosted ginger cookie says, chewy brown sugar cookie spiked with warming ginger and fragrant vanilla. That's it. That's exactly what this smells like. And it's not that artificial, I want to be a frosted ginger cookie. It's authentic, baked fresh out of the oven, going to fool people into think that I'm baking ginger cookie. It's to die for. Um, I get that a lot with Scentsy in the fall. People will walk into my house and they're like, what are you making? I'm making nothing because... The only people I can't fool really are my kids. My kids know that I couldn't bake to save my life or raise money. I'm the kind of mom that jets out to Metro for the school bake sales. I dump all the goodies onto a tray, arrange it, try and fool people into thinking I'm some June cleaver. But I'm not. I just love delicious Scentsy. So join me for part two of my Bring Back My Bar haul. Stick around. <laughs>